what is up you guys it's Magento. Uh today I want to show you how to install presets on MacBooks specifically this is for mostly Mac users um, I know that Peach has a tutorial on how to do it for Windows and that's kind of how I figured it out but it wasn't the most obvious for me and it kind of took a little bit and now that I know how to do it I would like to share that with you so if you have DaVinci open already just close it because we'll have to restart it anyways this is the preset that I want to install this is a old edge detect uh, it has a threshold uh, like in the previous version of resolve and the new edge detect doesn't have that and it feels different so I like this one better because of the glitches that I was able to make in the one framers so next um, you go to your finder, go to preferences, go to hard disks, go to your Macintosh HD, go to your library, and then go to application support. If you have the website version of DaVinci Resolve, you should have this folder. I recommend the website version. Uh, in other words, the version that came out on the website specifically, and not the version that's on the App Store, because if you get the one on the App Store, you won't have this folder. So you go into Blackmagic Design, go into Dimitri Resolve, go into Fusion, and next go into Templates, then go into Fusion, then go to Custom. And if you have nothing here yet, uh, custom should be empty. There should be nothing here. And all you need to do is create your own folders for your own presets or move folders from what you've gotten from a pack or anything and move it here. For example, Peach's Shake Pack. That is a um, already created folder. So once you have this and you know the folder you want to put it in, just take your preset from wherever you have it and put it into the folder that you want it in and after that just close everything and reopen resolve and on your timeline if you have an adjustment clip or whatever you have there just go into it and go to templates after you press the effect tab and then go into fusion go into custom and go to whatever folder that you put it in and as you can see I have the preset on the no grid and it has a threshold just to show you that this is the same preset that I was talking about and essentially you can basically have any nodes or any group of nodes um, saved as a preset and real quick I can show you how to save presets so when you have whatever node or set of nodes that you want to save as a preset so let's just say I have more than one node you highlight all the nodes you right click on all of them go to settings and then go to save as and a file like the one that I had on my desktop should appear so I'll show you what that looks like and just name it whatever you want press save and it should be saved to the area that you sent it to I sent it to my desktop so here it is and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed that tutorial